मल्टीप्लीमेट्रिक मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑपरेशन दैट इज रो फर्स्ट रो फर्स्ट कॉलम एंड एड इट लाइक टू टाइम्स वन टू प्लस जीरो टाइम्स टू जीरो प्लस वन टाइम्स माइनस वन माइनस वन दिस इज माई फर्स्ट वैल्यू सिमिलरली आई कैन डू रेस्ट ऑफ द वैल्यू सो वट आई एम गोइंग टू डू डायरेक्टली वट विल बी द ऑपरेशनल आंसर दैट आई एम गोइंग टू राइट इट ओवर हियर ओके so first answer will be 1 okay now second 201 should be multiply with this so 2 ones are 2 0 minus 1 0 1 2 is 2 so 2 plus 2 is 4 similarly the third one 2 minus negative 1 is negative 2 0 0 1 3 is 3 so negative 2 and 3 if you add you will get again 1 1 okay this is my first row now 3 times 1 is 3 0 times 2 is 0 2 times negative 2 is negative 2 so yes, 3 times 1 1 great now 3 times 1 is 3 0 times minus 1 is 0 2 times 2 is 4 so 3 plus 4 is 7 okay and yes. 3 times minus 1 is minus 3 0 times 0 is 0 2 times 3 is 6 so, so 6, 6 times 2 will be 3 Right? Yes. Okay. Now you tell me the third row, so I will just write it. Okay. Um, zero times one is zero. Plus two times one is two. Uh, minus four plus so negative two. Negative two. Great. Uh, what do you mean um, second one? Zero times one is zero. Uh, negative one. Uh, plus eight. Um, positive seven. Positive seven. And the third value? Um, twelve. Twelve. Okay. Okay. Now, uh, this is the way when it is three by three matrix. Now, if it's a four by three or three by four or larger matrix, means large order, higher order, we call them higher order. So uh, all of this is the same thing. We are going to check that row number and times column number of suppose row one, row two, column one, row one, column one. And row two and uh, column two, we are going to check these two are getting equal or not. If any matrix, you will get four over four by three matrix, and next matrix is uh, three by two matrix. So if this is matching, we can get the resultant as four by two matrix. Yes. Right. So yeah. this one is you have to keep in mind how when you are going to. so now let me take you to the next part of that uh, matrix multiplication that when a matrix is multiplied with a uh, identity matrix now what is identity matrix as a new term 
identity matrix means it has <coughs> 101 this is called identity matrix now this is an example of 3 by 3 matrix if i want to give a 2 by 2 matrix example it should be this suppose 1001 so this is my example for 2 by 2 matrix now if you multiply when you are going to multiply any matrix with the identity matrix so what is happening if you multiply the number with 1? Suppose uh, you are taking 100. 100 into 1, how much? 100. 100. Okay. Uh, if I multiply 4 into 1, how much? 4. 4. 10 into 1, how much? Uh, 10. 10. So what is the pattern here you can notice? What is the pattern here? You are multiplying it by 1. If you multiplying by one, what is the pattern? Um, it's just it's for, the number. What is happening? It's just the same number. That, um, same like, number. Same number. That is that is a very nice term. Same number. So if you are multiplying anything with an identity matrix, you will get the same matrix. Same matrix. Same matrix. Let's have a check with an example that uh, what I said it is happening or not. Uh, suppose I am taking a 2 by 2 matrix. Suppose the matrix is 4, 3, 2, 1. And identity matrix I am taking as 1, 0, 0, 1. So my matrix multiplication is possible. Do you agree? Yes, it's possible. Yes, it is possible. Okay. Okay. So what I am supposed to do? Row times column, right? Yes. So See, 4 times 1 is 4, 3 times 0 is 0. So my first value is 4. Now second one, 4 times 0 is 0, 3 times 1 is 3, 3. Now the second row, 2 times 1 is 2, 1 times 0 is 0, so 2. So 2 times 0 is 0, 1 times 1 is 1. So now you'll check my, what is the matrix I have taken, and this is my identity matrix, I will multiply what matrix I am getting? Uh, it's the same. Same. So similarly, you can have a check with 3 by 3 matrix also. You will get same. Okay. So this is the this is the identity. Like it is working like one of, uh, what is called? How you are taking a number system, what is the value of one? That is the value of, uh, what is called? Identity matrix. Identity matrix. Okay. okay. Another term I'd like to say that zero matrix. Okay. Now zero matrix is what? Zero matrix means it will work like an at number. Suppose I'm going to check, suppose two plus zero. What is happening? It's just two. Two. Four plus zero. How much? Four. Four. Ten plus zero. How much? Ten. Ten. That means this is additive identity. What is this? Additive identity. If you add this number zero with any number, so it, it is giving same, right? Same. Yeah. Similarly, zero matrix also same operation will give. Now, if you multiply something with zero matrix, that like if you multiply instead of addition, if you do two into zero, what you will get? Zero. Zero. Four into zero, how much you will get? Zero. Okay, 10 into 0, how much you'll get? Zero. So in this pattern, you can identify when you're multiplying zero matrix with anything, you are getting zero. Okay, so two example I'm going to take. Okay, uh, suppose the first example is, I'm going to take this one only. 4, 3, 2, 1 is my matrix. I'm going to do an addition, 0, 0, 0, 0. So I will get now. Uh, another part of the matrix is when you talk about zero matrix, you have to match with the order of the matrix. Okay, like you can't can't write only zero. You have to maintain the order when you're writing zero matrix. This is two by two zero matrix, like this three by three zero matrix. Am I clear? Yeah, it's the same uh, dimension. Yeah. So four plus zero is four. Three plus zero is three. 2 plus 0 is 2, 1 plus 0 is 1. Similarly, if I multiply now 4, 3, 2, 1, 
If I multiply with 0, 0, 0, 0, what is supposed to be? Tell me. 0, 0, 0, 0. So the same operation which is happening for the number, same kind of operation will have for, uh, happen for matrix. Only the orientation or presentation are different. Am okay. I clear? Yeah. Okay. Sounds good. Okay. Now, <clears throat> okay. Now let me give some question which is uh, which are like multiplication of three by three and all. Okay. Yeah. 